This is a quick video showing the parts for a concept mount for the CB500X. So this is a three quarter inch aluminum tube, a quarter twenty threaded rod, two grommets that actually fit inside of the ends of the tube. I found these in the parts bin at Lowe's. Nylock nuts and washers. These are stainless. Ideally, you'd have stainless rod, but couldn't find it and no one had it in stock. It's expensive anyway. So the idea is this whole assembly, if you have your windshield in the top position, in the upper mount position, this whole assembly will fit in between the two upper holes of the windscreen. If you take the windscreen off the bike, you can fit this in there and then clamp this washers and nut on either end and clamp this into the windscreen. I'm hoping that the rubber bushings are going to provide enough isolation and also prevent this rod from twisting once it's clamped up. So I'm going to install it on the bike and test it out and we will see how it works. So here's the uh, bar mount mounted onto the windscreen brackets. The key to this is to get the length of the bar correct such that when you have this installed you are compressing these rubber bushings about a total of an eighth of an inch or a little bit more. So you want to, when you push this thing in here, you're going to bow the windscreen outwards and then clamp it back down and set this distance to be the installed distance on the bike. So on my bike, outside the bracket to outside the bracket is eight and three quarters of an inch. So I've got that basically compressed down to that length. The other thing you want to make sure is you've got the threads engaged into the nylon part of the nut on both sides of the brackets. It feels like it's going to work. Um, it's, it, this bar does not want to rotate. I don't want to spin it and gouge up the, the um, grommets, but I think it's going to work. I'm going to try it out and mount some things on it, try it out for a while, and let you know if it has any issues.